So what's good YouTube man? It's your boy Tony D2 Wild checking in once again. We are outside of Berlin right now. It's snowing beautifully. We're about to get picked up by our Uber right now. We have an E-Class e Mercedes about to pull up and take us to the uh, arena of Berlin. They say it like backwards, which is where SneakerCon will be held at. Your boy is seriously tired right now. Like, man. But I'm going to make it through the day. We're going to end off Europe with a bang. I hope to have a great time here bring you guys along show you all of the sneaker con, see the sneaker culture here in Germany, and just see how it is compared to back home. And like I said, man, end it all with a bang, and just, you know, get prepared for New York, which will be next week. So without further ado, sneaker con Berlin, let's get it. The snow is real out here, y'all. So this is where it's at, it's just something like, I don't know, it's creepy out here. So we just made it to the van. They have not even let anybody in yet. Today, basically, we're gonna be just some normal, you know, people that just enjoy the event because the fact that our fucking merch once again got held up in traffic. But it's all good. We got the we know we know what it is from now on. We have to get the shit sent to the hotel rather than the event because that's what's causing this delay. But um, we're gonna look around. I already have spent like about a grand, bought four pairs of kicks while out here, so I'm gonna try my best not to really cop anything, but if something just happens to fall in my lap for a good price, I'll pull the trigger, you feel what I'm saying? But I'm gonna try my best to just be just be normal for once and enjoy the event, meet some people, talk to some people, and hopefully get a good vlog out of it. So we'll just see how it goes and I'll go from there, man. All right, guys, so we out here, man. We got, you know, this is one of the lanes right here. We got Mike and them over here. Where's Mike? There he is, right there. Mike, <laughs> right, right, bro. He's right here, man. Hey, right guys, what's up? 4K, we out here in 4K. We got Yeezy busted in the building. So look, you guys be tagging me with my Yeezys on <laughs> and tagging this man in here. So I need you to either expose me or give me the check mark so they can leave me the fuck alone. I drop a Yeezy picture, Yeezy Buster, Yeezy Buster. They're fake, good fakes. I need you to either clap, if it's if they're fake, you gotta clap me, or you gotta give me the pass, sooner or later. Or we could just leave it up to them. Or that too. <laughs> I'm just kidding, no. Sooner or later, I'm gonna get my check. Tony's legit. I'm gonna get my oh, check yeah. mark, and y'all gonna leave me the you, fuck alone, you know, man. You know he's verified, he gets that check. <laughs> hey man, I got my guy Florio right here, man. Huge shout out, man. Major supporter right here. Go Thanks ahead. a lot, Henry. Hi, everybody. Shout out to my wife, Letitia, and my two boys, Tyrese and Jaden. I love you from the bottom of my heart. Yeah, and I'm here with Tony D in Berlin, sneaker come. Check it out. Let's get it, man. <laughs> two and a half, eight and a half, ten and a half. So these were the ones I was looking at right here. They want a little bit more though than when I can get back home. Cause you get about two hundred dollars right now, USD. But I'm only like two at two twenty euros, so just a little bit off the hip. Off white oak, top three gold right there. What's the check it out right here? It's a dope ass collection right here. DB threes, laser fours. Cannot lie, I was never a fan of the fusions, but looking back at it, it's like this is a little bit of history. And they're dope. They're dope to look at. I would not wear them still, but they are definitely like something dope. Just to have in your collection, you know what I'm saying? Remember these right here too. I wanted these so bad when I was a boat, boat, boat boy in high school. So these are supposed to be coming back out. I don't know which colorway, but this is a retro coming so Definitely gonna add that to the collection. Boy, you know you ain't with that. Boy, you know you ain't about that. Oh, oh, oh. I ain't with the chit chat. Now, so much you know your house at. Boy, you a little pet rat. Wait, she's not with me, so what's time to We got the Kickstarter booth, man. They got the whole Christmas tree decked out with the tin off white on your bit. I might need to do something like this, man. Christmas tree. I know Connor TV, you hit me up, brother. Might have to do a little something special for my Christmas tree coming soon. Got some like customs made right here as well. Every sneaker con kickstart come through with tons of sneakers and these motherfuckers sell out almost every time. I'm talking about this whole table will be gone. Now I don't know about this one in particular, but they usually sell like all this shit out. I know when it's in Australia, they kept that shit moving and they were fucking evaporated at the end of the event. Another one of the kicks that uh, I've been wanting for a little minute now. 
but it's unfortunate just having been on my, you know, um, they have, I haven't seen a lot of these popping up, honestly, at the Scooter Cone. Bulls seem to have caught a little W. Huh? Oh, yeah, some. Yeah. Yeah. Some light? Huh? Some Hopefully, light. yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see, we'll see, though. Man, I don't know. Yeah, they're real. <laughs> His face is just like... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Stand the camera. <laughs> get, your, get your weight up, buddy. Huh? Ooh, wee. Pink box. All right, guys. So I had to go ahead and hop on these right here, and it's not what you may think. This ain't just no typical. This ain't no Adidas. It's no that. I had I had to make a quick move on these kicks because it's something that I really wanted to add to the collection. So just wait and see to the end of this vlog. Oh yeah, sure you betcha, man. Want to go in the boot and sauce the puck around you? I get tired of these Your fucking bud? Canadians. Stop bringing them here. What's up guys, this is Tony D2 Wild. We back with another video, back with another visual, back at it like a motherfucking crack addict pussy popping on a dinosaur handstand. We're at Sneaker Con, we're gonna be taking a look at some panther pussy, some rhino vagina, some, I, I, what does Tony even say? Tony, you have some weird sayings, dude. I'm Tony D2 Wild, and I'm not a child child, but I'm about to win-win, sipping on the hen-hen, and we going in-in. And we gonna get it, get it. And I'm gonna wet it, wet it. This, this is like what Tony does, right? Something like that. Pussy. That's bang time for the one time. Hold up, let's see, let's see. Tony ain't got no hops, bro. What you talking about, dog? Look at this, look at this, look at this rim, bro. It's like, it's like two feet tall. Watch out. Yeah, yeah. Hi! Hey, hey, for the one oh, time. Oh, boy. Ah. Hey, he made me think about it. He just, he just purposely got, he like, just purposely on, got posterized. He was, he was sliding over like, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was like, what the? He set himself up. I don't even know what just happened. He said, hold on. He said, hold on. I need a game. I'm a shooter, get it down the rack. Yo, diamond fake, I ain't last. Fuck it, love bitch, for one nigga, that's bad. She want ass. I feel the coke, do I last? Run to the money, you know it's mad. Wait, fuck nigga, better run. Be when I chop it, you're on a drum. All right, guys, so SneakerCon Berlin is getting wrapped up now. We got the package. We secured the deal. And uh, it was another successful SneakerCon internationally. Really enjoyed it. Really loved the vibes here. But we're gonna head back to the hotel room and probably go from there. We're probably gonna go from the hotel straight back to the crib because back to the crib in Atlanta because we have a long ways to go. We're gonna pull out and show you what we guys uh, secured the bag here. Secure the bag, bitch. All right, guys, so we are back in the room and a whole day has passed, man. We basically came back to the room. I knocked out and woke up at like 5 a.m. Or actually like 11 p.m. We went back to sleep, woke up at 5 a.m. And we went to go eat uh, breakfast real quick. Christian's in the building. I'm yes, about sir. to dip on him. Oh, nice yeah, seeing you, I'm sir. Chilling, chilling He's going to be chilling here in the room because I have to go catch an early flight from Berlin to London and from London to Atlanta. I'll be home at 6 p.m. tomorrow, basically, in Atlanta. Well, actually, I think it's like midnight over there now, so actually today. Uh, it was nice, man. Berlin was definitely dope. I'm going to go ahead, though. We're going to wrap it up with some B-roll. Get back to the crib. I'm gonna show you all, you know, show you what I recently, you know, uh, picked up today from the Sneaker Con event, and we'll end it off there. So, without further ado, guys, let's get back to the states. Let's get it. All right, guys. So I'm just now getting home. It is actually 5:50 p.m. as we speak, and I got home today at I want to say 8 a.m. Now, my normal flight yesterday was from London straight to Atlanta. It was going to be, um, well, I had to get from Berlin to London and London straight to Atlanta. I would have been home Sunday at 6 p.m. That totally went just shit out of this. It was just dead. It just died. Basically, I had to fly um, from Berlin to London. I got in late because of the snow in London and I had to book a whole different flight in which I flew from London to New York. I landed in New York, at, I believe, at 2 I'm about like 12, like 1, 2. Had to stay up all the way till 6 o'clock and then catch a flight from New York to Atlanta. And then, you know, then I got in and now I'm here today. My pickup, guys, was the Nike SB Black Pigeon Low. I was able to get these for 190. Well, that's how much it converted out to. It was like, I think, 130 uh, euros or 160 euros. I can't remember the exact price, but it converted out to be $180. This was a sneaker I've been wanting for a minute now. 
It's just a dope overall black sneaker, but it's a staple pigeon. One of my favorite brands of all times. And the first one was amazing. This one, they brought it back. I just couldn't pass up on it. You can get them for a decent price. They were on StockX for like, I see 194, 190, 195. With the shipping fee, I would've been paying around 212. So I actually got it for a little bit cheaper than what I'll be paying resell for it, uh, you know, anywhere else. So huge shout out to the people there. Actually, the people who I got them from is Soul to Soul, S-O-U-L to S-O-L-E, Soul to Soul, BC.com. I'll make sure to link them down below, man. Huge shout out to them for the love and support on that. They hooked their boy up with a good price. Real dope people out in Berlin and Germany and London, France. I really loved it. And Amsterdam, of course, too. Thank you, everybody, who tuned into all the vlogs. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart for the continuous support. Make sure you guys slap a like, you comment down below, and subscribe. I'm about to go ahead and get this edited out to you, drop it today so I can kick back, relax, enjoy some snacks. Tomorrow we got some reviews, tons of shit coming soon. And we get my car. It's your boy Tony D2Wild, man. I'm checking in, I'm checking out. Peace.